Hey, welcome back. It's Jay Byron from Custom Painted Gunstocks here with Tony Metal and Hillbilly Customs. How are you today, Tony? Alright, how are you doing? Good. Hey, we got some finished work here, Tony. What do you think? It's uh, something a little bit different, huh? Yep. Yeah, what we had here is a couple buddies here that they uh, think they're on the same shooting team or something and they uh, they wanted to match. So yep. they got different brands of guns. One of them's a Remington 1100. The yellow one is a uh, Beretta 390. And, uh, and then we have a Macmillan Edge uh, bench rest sitting back here in the back uh, behind these. But uh, anyway, just wanted to show our American flag gun. I thought it would look pretty cool, so we got a video of it. Yeah. So uh, anyway, this is all airbrushed here, uh, painted. Uh, these are. So uh, here's a, more of a finished product. These things have some shine to them, don't they, Tony? They sure do. So anyway, we put some work into it. There's the Remington 1100 right there. And then uh, we had, had hand painted the guy's name on it right here, his last name. And uh, so it's got the stars and stripes on it. So something pretty neat. And uh, it, it should make him shoot better, Tony. Oh yeah, they always make him shoot better. Yep, and right here we had the Beretta 390. Same deal, it's got a lot of shine to it and stars and stripes. Took the checker and out on this one right here, we put an extended uh, you know, uh, pistol cap right here so it can grab his whole hand and that kind of helps because my pinky kind of grabs that too you know and yeah. I don't have real big hands but yeah. you know if you got big hands that's a that's a pretty good deal so it's a, just an add-on it, it uh, actually group we screw it on then we glue it on right there and then fill this all in and, and uh, it just makes the you know the grip a lot you know where you can you know get your hand around it more so it makes it a little bit more comfortable for the shooter and that's all yep. about fitting on a shotgun yeah we know that so uh anyway here's a finished product on this thing and there's the forearm for the beretta and the forearm for the remington so something pretty neat i'll turn them over right here and uh because we painted this side too tony said it might want to do that <laughs> so we painted both sides of the gun so anyway uh but here they are. They're pretty neat looking. And this is what we do. So uh, anyway, we take them uh, and customize them all up. Make them pretty. Did a little something a little different with the stripe right there and right there. We thought that looked pretty neat. So uh, anyway, we got some half the customers here. So they're going to they're gonna be different, aren't they, Tony? Yep, they're going to stick out. That's right. And that's what it's all about. It's all about personalizing and making yours different from everybody else's. That's right, you don't want to go to the gun rack and sit there for an hour trying to find your own gun. That's right, and that's that's a good purpose for it too. So that's a that's a that's a good point looking at it. So anyway, and uh, like I said, this is what we do. And, and here's the uh, McMillan bench rest gun. You see it's got a lot of shine on it. These things got a lot of clear coat on them, don't they, Tony? They sure do. Well, it's not so much they got a lot of clear on them, I just, you know, these are different, done in different stages, and you know, this uh, this is actually cleared one time, and it sets a few days, and gets spot sanded back down, and re-clear coated again, and color sanded, and all buffed out to a high luster, and it's got a real durable clear coat on it, and uh, and it's, you know, it's nice. Too. You can put actually, you can put a coat of wax on them too. So, yeah. you know, that's what's so cool about them, is that they do hold up nice and take care of them. Uh, they'll last for a long time. So anyway, we just wanted to share our custom paint work and uh, what we had ordered here and and, uh, and what we painted up for these guys. And and uh, stay tuned in to our channel because we always got some cool looking projects like this going on, don't we, Tony? So, we sure do. So anyway, we got a lot more coming. Yep. And uh, so um, and check us out on our Facebook too. This, I was just telling Tony, this McMillan Bentress stock here, it looks completely different in person than it does on camera. It does. It seems like it's darker in person. Yeah, and it, for some reason the camera makes everything a little bit lighter than what it really is. Yeah, that's right. So the colors are a little bit more pure when you see them yeah. up close, you know, and in person by your own eyes. So, yeah. but uh, anyway, they look pretty good on camera. Oh yeah. You know, so anyway, you can get a pretty good idea. But uh, anyway, uh, there's something different. We'll probably show the top of the gun too. So how we did the top. How everything matches up all the way around and got some shadowing in there and uh man i tell you what this is something i've hadn't done an american flag gun up to like this have you know before i don't believe it we've done a couple some that's kind of like a usa thing but yeah, first time we, first time we wrapped it with the flag huh yeah so it looks like it's wrapped with a flag but 
anyway uh, just wanted to share that with you guys and and like I said you can check us out on the web at www.custompaintedgunstocks.com or .net either one will take you there and check out Tony's page he does the fancy engraving on his page at Hillbilly Customs on Facebook and Custom Painted Gunstocks on Facebook so we work here all together at the same one location and uh, just wanted to share our projects with you and, and uh, we keep making film about stuff like that and this, yeah. you know so uh, uh, I, I think it's pretty something pretty neat yeah. and uh, something you guys might enjoy want something done on your gun you might want the uh, Italian flag put on your gun yeah. so you know like Beretta. yeah let's yeah like this Beretta here but I guess this will be a Beretta USA gun I guess yeah. that's how yeah that's what we can call that but uh, anyway thanks for uh, watching and subscribe to our channel if you want to watch more of our videos and and see more of our updates on our new projects but Anyway, thanks for watching, and have a good day. You want to tell them bye, Tony? Bye. We'll see you later.